Hi guys, Root the Lucario here, and today I'm gonna be talking about VPNs. And what you may not know about them. So, what you may be asking to yourselves, what VPN do I use? You mean you might be ask you might ask me what VPN do I use or I recommend and I'm not recommending or promoting any VIP services because I'm not pimping. I'm not recommending or promoting any VPN service because I'm not affiliated, so I'm not pimping. That means I got your back. A lot of a lot of VPN companies in the past have given people up at some point for illegal activity like they given themselves they given customers up to a, to authorities for, for for illegal activity well they the only the only reason why a YouTuber would promote a VPN is because of one reason and one reason only. It's because they get a large sum of money for for in, for helping them endorse their products. And And yes, they do ask for information from you when you pay for one. Because they they want to monitor they want to trace back any data to you. So if you were to commit any crimes on the internet using their servers they can pin the blame on you and let me summarize like this it'll be three o'clock it'll be 12 a.m and at midnight and you'll be asleep and all of a sudden you'll wake up and handcuffs in the back of a squad car in the back of a squad car you don't do you actually think that a VPN is gonna give you complete invisibility on the internet for a cost of only Leave four euros a month. It's just never gonna happen. I mean, their its whole purpose is to collect data. And yes, you can use a VIP to be invisible on to your ISP to a certain degree, but then you're trusting some VPN company run by people you don't even know enough in person. You know, these people can be running them from way far out of your country, for all I know.
I mean, don't listen to to the V don't listen to VPN ads. Don't because on their website they're just gonna it's just a big whole advertisement just to sell their VPN. Alright, they're gonna say how fast did it how very fast it is, how you'll be invisible to everyone and no one and if you do any sort of bad behavior no one's gonna no one can know who you are so they can't really report you on a, on on websites well let me explain to you how the real world works in the real world when everywhere you go when you're around civilized people they're gonna ask some sort of questions about about yourself whether like say for instance you go to school the teacher is gonna ask for your first and last name on the test if if you apply for a job you're gonna be asked some personal information like your name your ID or social security when you register to vote same thing so there's basically no way to hide information about yourself every back in the caveman days it was really hard to communicate. People were weren't civilized. We were beating each other up with clubs and and just not knowing how to talk. We were still trying to be we were still getting used to civilization. But now, but nowadays, you're going to be asked a lot about yourself everywhere you go. Different places ask you different things about yourselves, maybe even some of the same. I mean, there's no way to keep your personal information safe. I guess you can on from internet hackers and stuff, but it's not even then it's not 100% foolproof. I mean unless you live out somewhere far in the woods or in a cave somewhere then you're gonna be around civilized people and they're gonna be asking you questions about yourself so just face facts that's how civilized people work Same scenario with VPNs. They keep logs. They keep data. Anything that... Any activity that goes on... In a VPN is... Stored in... In, in a servers that they rent. They monitor data 24-7. Anything that goes on in the VPN gets monitored on the by the VPN companies. The only people who would know what goes on in the VPNs is the VPN company themselves and the people who own them servers. So you just have to use a bit of common sense. People, people 
try to add more security to VPNs and those VPNs must run at dial-up speed or at a snail's pace. It must be super slow. <sighs> so... You just... You just gotta... Think. They advertise it, mislead people, and... People think they can do all sorts of bad things on the internet, no matter what it be. But if you have that, but that, but if you have that mentality, then you're gonna be finding out very soon that authorities will be knocking down your door, will be kicking down your door, and barging into your house with warrants already with warrants all with search warrants already printed out and with warrants already printed out Yeah, no, there actually is no best VPN out there. I mean, it's not super fast. I can, their whole, their whole website has, has information, has misleading, has false, has misleading or false information that it's fast and that people won't be able to see what you're doing on the internet you th you think you don't think a VPN company is going to ruin their business just to let you run free just for a payment of 3 to 5 euros a month it's just not going to happen You, I mean, if you are around civilization, then you're going to be asked questions about yourself. So, just bear that in mind. Because... Nowhere is identity ask free, as I like to call it. Because just wake up, face reality. When you move to another country, they're going to be asking questions about yourself. When When your when your when you, your child gives you a, f a form, it asks for your signature. It asks for at least your signature. So yeah, I mean. It's I mean, the school may not be able to share it around with a lot of other people, but still, they're collecting data about you. I just think people get misled into thinking they can do whatever they want with a VPN.
I mean... I go to school. I'm, I'm past high school and I... And, but I still go to school. I mean... Let's... Let's be real here. And just face facts. Your... Your data will... never gonna be 100% data collecting free in this world because everyone's data gets collected that's just how the real world works I mean how are you supposed to get a job if or pass a test that they don't that they don't know who you, who you are or have your name I mean there's so many things wrong on the internet so if a VPN company tells you you are going to be a hundred percent safe then they are and they are lying to you. So, yeah. That's all I have to say, and I hope this has been helpful to you. So why, so if it has, why not leave a like and subscribe? And, and click the notifications bell, and then click all for more content that I've done, that I've, that I, that I'm doing. That, that I'm doing so. Yeah. I'm... Hope this has been helpful to you. This has been Ruth the Lucario signing off.